tomorrow is movie day, and we all have to bring at least one movie. Um, are there any requirements? The movie has to be below our rating. Dang it. I don't think I have any movie at home that isn't below our rating. Well, I have those Disney movies, but I don't want to feel like a snowflake. Really? You don't have any other movies other than our rated? What about Forrest Gump, Jurassic Park? My granddad brought them along to New Zealand. Oh. Guess you'll have to buy one. This sucks. R-rated movies don't mean they're bad. A lot of them offer meaningful messages. Boo! The one and only DVD store in my area has closed down. This sucks. Now where can I get them stupid DVDs? Hum. Guess I'll just go to the library and see if they have any more DVDs. Yes, I'm going back to the one where I was unfairly kicked out last time all because I spoke the truth, and because that library is the closest one to my place where I can just walk for 8 to 10 minutes only. Doubt that stupid librarian guy is still there it's been 4 months. Remember the Titans. I remember that movie starring Denzel Washington has a very positive message, and it's only rated PG. I'm gonna pick this one. Hold on. Uh, what is it? You look familiar. Think I recognize you somewhere. Uh, think you made a mistake I don't know you hey listen I gotta go. Stop right there. I remember you now. You're that bald kid who caused problems at my library four months ago. Didn't I ban you permanently from coming here? You stay right here I'm calling the police. Look you stupid stinky donut it's been four months and I thought you only temporarily banned me. No! You are permanently banned and you're trespassing here right now. I'm calling 911. You are violating my constitutional rights. I came here just to rent a DVD for movie day tomorrow at school and you are calling the cops on me? Mister, you are violating my rights. I can sue you for every penny on that. And do you realize you're just wasting the police time? What are you, a male Karen? Oh, you look like one, a much filthier one, too. And you look like a sad, depressed virgin zebra that's begging for free sex in the streets of the Bronx. What did you say? How dare you insulted me that way? Yes! You are roasted, buddy. Deeply, deeply, brutally roasted up your buttocks. Now out of my way I'm gonna pay for this stupid DVD and this looks fake. What the are you selling bootlegs here? I should call the feds on you. Your intellect is as weak as your baldness. Failure is your destiny. You disrespect me and my library. You are made of stupid. You corrupt bastard. You are not getting away with this. Ouch my head. Jeez, what kind of roast was that? Doesn't make any sense at all. You know what? I have an idea. This one is a beast. It's a stun baton. Got it from a friend of mine who's a former Navy officer. One zap and you can knock someone out to sleeping beauty for at least 12 hours. Totally recommend this if you wanna take down your enemy without killing them. Hum, you got anything else? That's all I got. I mean I have this realistic looking toy revolver that shoots paper, but this one is usually for thieves and wannabe robbers thinking they're Michael D. Santa. Other than that if you're not robbing some poor bastard's businesses, the stun baton is a go-to for you. Hey listen this beast is a very hot item. Everyone's coming here to buy this, and I only have two left. So if I were you I'd buy this beast right away. Alright I'll take it. Thank you Mr. Anderson. If you need any more ideal weapons to defend yourself or take down scumbags like your father and little sister, come to me. I have all the great deals oh and I'm selling Harry Potter magic wand next week for 3 bucks only. It's exactly the same thing from the movies. I got it from some drunk naked British guy in some gay bar I hung out 2 days ago. Winger Dimly Viosa. What the? Oh my god. First of all, learn how to roast. You have the worst roasting in the entire universe. Your roasting is as weak as your intellect. Failure is your destiny. You disrespect yourself and your career. You are made of stupid. Second of all, you have no right to ban me. The past is past. I came here just to buy a DVD. Thirdly, learn the Harry Potter spells. 
Wingard M. Levio says to make objects fly. Did you even see the movie? Stupid bald bitch. I'm detaining you. Cops are coming. Yeah, I know what you're going to say as a matter of fact I'm gonna save your time and saliva. Oh, 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 how dare I trespass the library and shock the librarian with a stun baton. Do I not realize that I could have killed him with that? That's it, I am so grounded, grounded, grounded. I'm grounded for 829,383,283,782 days back in the claustrophobic attic sleeping with the bats, spiders, ants, rats, and roaches with no Wi-Fi phones, computers, TV, air, ventilation, etc. Period. Oh, I forgot this. Wah. Anyway, that's all. Oh, and guys, I'll be doing another tutorial video very soon. I'll be showing you how to steal your neighbor's Wi-Fi. Please stay tuned. And don't forget to press the like button, share this video, turn the notification bell on and subscribe to the Redemption Films channel. I'll catch you next time once I get out of the police station. Bye.